The first experience was when I got a link from Patrick to test the tool and I was surprised and the level was really, really high. Because my results were uh, not so good as I expected. And it was fun because after a second trial, my results were better. And I realized that it was really nice because of the movies you recorded in the tool instead of pictures. So really, really great experience. And my second one was I decided to test it with customers. And it was amazing to see that the results in the beginning in the test phase were really bad, 20%. And after training, people had 75, 80%. So it means that for me, the tool is really useful and really a lot of challenges because it's difficult in the beginning. It's really useful because you have real situations, real people. And so it's like you talking to me in the tool or Patrick talking to me or all the people talking to you during the training. And it's like you watch your neighbor. And it's not like in other tools I know that where you have uh, some pictures who are just a little bit moving. So it's really reflecting reality. And it's why it's in the beginning, it's more difficult. But it's really useful because you learn micro expression and identification of it uh, a good way uh, in, the real, in the real life. I think in sales meeting for sales managers, for sales people with customers, it's uh, really useful to detect these micro expressions because in Belgium people are so nice with words and they don't tell you all the time what they are feeling. So f in sales meeting you can, you can be more efficient in the way you, you finish your meeting and say, okay, I saw something that's not okay with the words. So I will ask an extra question. So I think it's for the sales results, you will have better sales results when you use micro expressions. For HR manager who are doing recruitment, uh, I'm convinced they will uh, get better results from interviews and they will uh, be able in one interview to get more info from the candidate instead maybe of a second one or third interview. And I th I'm, I'm sure that people also will be sure when somebody will sign a contract they will be sure that it is the good candidate instead of hiring somebody and realizing six months later or three months later that this is not the good or the right person on the right place so in hr i'm convinced that this is a great tool to be efficient and to recruit the right person for the right job